everyone. So today I just wanted to do a basic introduction to uh, SPSS statistics. Um, to start, we are going to look at a basic problem. Uh, this problem is comparing two different drugs on uh, female mice in order to see how it affects their number of babies in a litter. So you have group A, which is the drug given, and then group B, which is no drug given. And then we're basically going to put this into SPSS, um, run a few different things, uh, like finding the statistics of mean, median, mode, um, the standard deviation variance, and such things, as well as building a pretty basic bar graph to be able to see the difference in how this, how this actually works. So to start, we are actually going to put in the different variables. Uh, the first one we will have as group, which will be group A or B. And the second one we'll have as babies. Um, we'll both have them as numeric because even though it's group A or B, we can label the different values. So we'll label group as just group and then we'll have babies as the number of babies and then value we will have zero as control and then one as drug okay uh, there doesn't have to be any values for the babies one and then the measure for this will be nominal just because there's no ordered difference. So it's just one or the other, so it doesn't have to be anything else. Um, and the babies will be scale, because it's a countable number. And then the input is the independent variable, which is the drug given, which is control or the drug. And then the target is the dependent variable, which is what you're measuring, or the number of babies. Um, and now we can go and let's change the decimals on this to zero. Okay. So now we can put in the data according to the picture I showed before. We'll do zero, zero, and one, one. And if you also click here, you can make it as control or drug. And then now we are going to put in the number of babies per litter. Okay, cool. Now that's done. So now you have your data inputted. The next step will be to um, split the file. Data, split file, organ click compare groups. You're going to have the groups based on the group variable, which is A or B, the drug versus the control. Then press OK. And it's going to have this output sheet that you can see. And then you're going to go to Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, and then Frequencies. Um, you're going to put both of your variables on the variable side. You're going to click the statistics you want. So mean, median, mode, sum, standard deviation, variance, min, and max. OK. Uh, make sure you have the format set is what you want to do is compare the variables and then just press OK and you'll have the statistic pop up which what you'll want to focus on is the number of babies in each so each one had 10 standard deviation was 1.247 for the control compared to the 3.247 standard deviation in the drug and that'll be that um, and then what you'll want to do is create a basic graph. So for this, you want to go back to split file to analyze all groups to not base them on that. And then you'll go to graphs, chart builder, and then create a simple bar graph. You'll have the group on the bottom and the number of babies on the Y axis. You'll do this based on mean for each one. We should have something pop up. Yep, just like that. And then you can you can always go back 
um, edit as you want, change the colors. You know, we can even go back and add confidence intervals to the different ones. And then just press OK. And it'll have confidence intervals for the graph. And it'll be easy enough to go through and change the colors if we wanted to. But that is the basics of using some variables and creating some statistical data. Thank you.